Science. The road to Fam El Hissim in southeastern Morocco is a lonely, hot, and dusty place. The harsh climate and low rainfall means little grows here. The changing climate conditions are most noticeable in places like Tanzindo, where the palm trees used to be part of an oasis. But rain doesn't always provide welcome relief. Long periods of drought are often followed by severe flash flooding. In the oasis, when it rains, it takes the shape of stormy rains, and it gives no benefit. It leads to soil erosion. In the past 30 or 40 years ago, the width of Hajaj River was 10 meters. But today, in some areas, the width of this river could reach 500 meters. The High Commission for Water Forests and the Fight Against Desertification says the scarcity of water and the moving sand dunes are the worst challenges the local populations have to face. Riverbeds are widening every year, making it difficult for local populations to move freely. When bridges are destroyed by the floods, villages are isolated, sometimes for weeks. This member of the local council of the rural commune of Sukhramis Dades says his people are suffering and need help. Nobody is helping us. As you can see, there's no water in the river and the wells are starting to dry up. From where shall we bring water? We need a little bit of help to be encouraged. With the help of its international partners, the High Commission is implementing a new 10-year national plan to fight desertification until 2024. This plan is based on awareness, partnership and participation by local, regional and national players.